topic will cover Element Renumber Utility. It is part of the full suite of Imaginet Technologies Utilities for Revit. To find the Element Renumber tool, from the Imaginet tab, Imaginet Utilities, Renumber drop-down, choose Element Renumber. Element Renumber Utility provides an easier method to renumber selected element types. In the Element Renumber dialog box, Element Type, Type drop-down, choose the type that you want to renumber. I want to choose Doors. For the Renumber option, you have a choice of Renumbered Elements in Selected Order or Insert a Number and Renumber Affected Elements. I'm going to start with Renumber Elements in Selected Order. Selection Method. You have a choice of Pick Individual Elements in Desired Order or Pick Elements by a Path of Line Segments or Use Window to Select Elements. I'm going to pick Individual Elements in Desired Order and then hit Next. I want to zoom in right into this area. I'm on Floor 2 in this particular project. So I'm going to pick on the doors of the order that I want to renumber. And then I just hit Escape on the keyboard. Then I have a choice to start my numbering. So I'm going to start with 201. I can come in here and fill these out individually, and as I'm picking in here, if you notice, it zooms into that particular door that I'm going to renumber to check it out. In this case, I'm going to start with 201, propose a sequence to elements below by picking on this button. And now if you notice, 2 now is going to be 201 and so on. Then down at the bottom, I can choose renumber. Now if you notice, they now are renumbered in the order that I selected them. Another way to select elements through the selection method area is to pick elements by a path of line segments. And then choose next. As you notice, I have a series of model lines I've drawn through my doors. So then I pick points on the path of the elements to renumber. And then I hit Escape when I'm done. Then the Renumber Elements dialog box shows up again. I start the renumbering. And then I propose sequence to renumber below. So now the proposal is in the order as I selected through the doors for my pick points. And then I pick renumber. The next selection method from the Element Renumber dialog box is to use Window to select elements and then pick on Next and Window the area. And then pick in a blank area to finish the selection. Type in a starting number. Pick on Proposed Sequence to Elements below. And then pick the Renumber button. Now, as you see, all the doors have been renumbered. Another renumber option from the Element Renumber dialog box is insert a number and renumber affected elements, and then pick Next. And then please pick the element which will be inserted and pick OK. This door is numbered 234, and I want it to be number 202, so I'll pick on it. Now I type the number that I want it to be, 202. You notice I have one in here already that's 202. Propose a sequence to elements below. So now as you notice, now we have a new sequence. And then pick the Renumber button. So as you notice, this is now 202 and then all others have been in a new sequence of renumbering. 